Hello, my name is Andrew Krill, and I'm the new principal at Tuolity Middle School. And as you know, a lot of changes are coming to Tuolity. And this summer, we've been getting ready. If you've had time to drive by the campus over this summer, you'll see that a lot of work has been done as the new Templeton gets built and finished, as well as the work that's being done on the old Tuolity campus. And we can't wait for the day where we can walk into our new building and call it home. Starting this fall, the old Templeton Elementary School will become the new Tuolity Middle School for the next 18 months or so. And this summer, our new administrative team has been getting together, getting to know one another, but also doing some really careful and thoughtful planning about what comes next and how to make Tuolity the safest school in the district. This is a picture of our new campus. A lot of our classrooms are gonna take place up on the track, some in the old Templeton building, some in the porches below. Our seventh and eighth grade classrooms are primarily gonna be up on the track. There's restrooms there, as well as one of our gyms. The main office, the music programs, the cafeteria, as well as our second gym will be in the old Templeton building. The sixth grade classrooms will mostly be on the south side of the porch, and then our science and steam classrooms are on the north side of the porch. Our triad of sixth grade teachers will also be in the new Templeton building. One of the first things we wanted to think about is what happens when students arrive at school in the morning. Our new campus is going to be borrowing the same bus route as the new Templeton Elementary School. So buses will come in and they're going to loop in front of the new Templeton Elementary School building. Our students are gonna be dropped off in area one on this map. Afterwards, they're gonna walk on a path next to the Templeton Elementary campus to area two and three, which are the covered porches. Teachers, administrators, and security staff will be spread out around the campus to make sure that kids are safe, respectful, and responsible. Since we are going to be sharing space next year, our parking lot is going to be extra, extra crowded. So if it's possible for your student to take the bus to school, that would be really helpful. If not, we're going to ask the parents drop off or pick up students in front of the old Templeton Elementary School building. There's going to be a marked route and a place for you to drop off and pick up your child. Another thing we wanted to think about was how lunch was going to work next year with our new campus. We were still gonna have the same schedule where there will be three lunches and sixth graders will have their own lunch. Because our cafeteria is going to be a little smaller, we wanted to make sure that students were able to get served food in different areas around the campus. And that will include an a la carte stand underneath our porches out back, as well as lunch being served in our traditional cafeteria. At the end of the day, students will depart school in the same place they were dropped off in the morning. If their last class was up on the track field, they will walk down in a safe path where they can either turn right to get picked up by a parent in front of our main office or continue down to the porches where there'll be a staging area for students. Students will know their bus is coming in a few different ways. The supervisors down on the porches will have an iPad which will have a Google Sheet that will say whether the bus has arrived or not. There will also be verbal announcements in addition to the ability for students to look up the Google Sheet themselves on their personal device. Since this is a new school year, we wanted to remind students of a couple more things. First, it's going to be really important that they come to school every day with their school-issued iPad and have it fully charged. Second, there will be no lockers next year, which means students will be carrying backpacks around from class to class. Therefore, it's really important that students are leaving really valuable items at home. Finally, students are going to be outdoors a bit more as they travel from the track into the main campus. So please dress for the weather. This is going to be an awesome school year and we 
really can't wait to meet you. Have a great summer, and we'll see you soon.